he's staying here until at least January. James Madison's back from injury, which is hugely significant. Wilfred and Didi and Luke Thomas also start. We expect Ndidi to play centre-back with Johnny Evans, with Daniel Amati out injured. Thomas replaces Timothy Castagna, who's on the bench. Eric Ten Hag is sticking with a winning team, and the consequence of that is that both Casemiro and Cristiano Ronaldo are on the subs bench again. It's the team that beat Liverpool and Southampton. Harry Maguire also misses out again with Varane alongside Martinez. Victor Lindelof is a sub for the first time this season. And Anthony completed his move to United today, but is ineligible for this one tonight. Fascinating, Jermaine, isn't it? Because you've got one team desperate to try and find form, and the other team, Manchester United, have suddenly found it. Yeah, I think in Manchester United's case, um, I don't think I'd call it form. I think that the performance against Liverpool was absolutely sensational. I think the performance against Southampton was a little bit different, but also had qualities where they were able to be resilient. And they're going to need more of that today. I think from Leicester's point of view, the window's been a huge distraction. There's no doubt about that. But today, as you've mentioned, the window closes this evening. These players know they're going to be Leicester City players. We can refocus. And I definitely expect Madison and Barnes in particular to cause this Manchester United defence a lot of problems. Thanks, Jermaine. For the first time since April 2015. Having said that, 12 months after that, they were Premier League champions, so it's not always doom and gloom. Manchester United's target is to win three Premier League games in a row for the first time since December. This is so often, Jermaine, been a very entertaining Premier League fixture. Just outside his wheelhouse, but he's, he's got this in the lockup. Madison does hit it, good save, David De Gea. Couldn't have hit that one any squeeze to James Madison. No, it was a great strike. I just think, as, we, as I said, I think it was just... Indeed it. Jules De Hall is trying to make the run in behind Ericsson here. Barnes has joined Vardy in the box. Good play from Dewsbury Hall, and it was fizzed in, and just a fraction high for Harvey Barnes. That's so much better from Leicester. Yeah, well, United gave them encouragement, and they've taken it. More good play from Dewsbury Hall, manipulating the ball. You can see Harvey Barnes on his way, it's just slightly too high in, and behind him. But much better from his Leicester side, a lot more players showing they want the ball. Here's the effort from Madison, he thought it was in, he was away. De Gea had it covered quite comfortably for him. It's James Madison and Kieran and Dewsbury Hall, the two players who are trying to clear. See what they can do from this Tielemans corner. It's worked nicely here for Dewsbury Hall for the shooting chance, straight at Malassia. 